The future of fashion is looking brighter. The EcoChic Design Award is the world's largest sustainable fashion design competition that inspires emerging designers to create high appeal fashion with minimal environmental impact. Using the sustainable design techniques of zero waste, upcycling and reconstruction, 10 finalists from Asia and Europe will showcase their fashion forward designs at Hong Kong Fashion Week. With coveted prizes on offer from John Hardy, the Langham Hong Kong, and a chance to design the first ever upcycled collection for Shanghai Tang. Join us as we follow four finalists on a journey to cut waste out of fashion. My name is Yvonne Tai, and I'm from Taiwan, Taipei. I'm a student right now. I'm studying at a Fujian Catholic University, the fashion department. My name is Kevin. I'm from Switzerland, and I'm the UK finalist. I'm a student at St. John's St. Martins in women's wear. I'm Victor. Now I'm a student in Poly University in Hong Kong, study fashion and textile design. I'm Laurentia from Singapore. Currently, I'm doing my final year in Raffles for fashion design. Yeah, I'm quite new with this sustainable fashion, but being a finalist is great. This is the first time that I joined like an international competition. So being the finalist, though a bit nervous, it's very exciting as well because I get to know more about sustainable fashion, which really excites me. Being a finalist, especially for the UK is quite a big deal and I feel it's under pressure but you know the other finalists are so nice we're having a lot of fun so far In a few days the finalists will present their sustainable collections to Asia's influential fashion figures at the EcoChic Design Award 2014-15 Grand Final at Hong Kong Fashion Week. I'm gonna go in now for the fitting. Yeah, I'm a bit nervous. The fitting is crucial to ensure that their clothes, models and their visions look perfect on the runway. The finalists will be working with famed stylist Denise Ho, who has already styled two previous cycles. Do you have a favorite outfit with a short one? Fitting, quite a lot of people going here, going there. <laughs> so many people. So I just stand there and I don't know what to do. <laughs> this one is the opening, right? No, the opening now is the, 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 the cute dress. Nervous is always my expression <laughs> and feeling. Do you want her to try? I think compared to last season, this is more innovative with the material they use. I mean, last season there's a lot of denim, and this season there's a lot more crochet patterns, uh, recycled yarn, and also felt, there was spray paint. So I think in that sense, it's becoming more and more interesting and creative. You know, when you add sustainability in your design, it makes it even more special and I would like to be a sustainable designer to show people that sustainable fashion can be really, really exciting. I think the best one is uh, Calvin because um, he is a great tailor. When I uh, see uh, Calvin and other founders, I feel so um, nervous because their design is very amazing and very good. I joined this competition because I want to challenge myself. All of us has the same chance of winning. I'm curious how it will turn up. As for this competition, like seeing my own design and to see others, it's going to be really intense, I think, because everyone is so good. But as long as I do my best, yeah, there's always possibility winning. And the fitting room, it was pretty intense because like everything works very quickly. So when you see it, you have to know like where to adjust. There are some adjustments I have to do. There's some clothes that are too long. Yeah. Over the next few days, not only will they be putting the final touches to their collections, but they must also prepare to wow the judges in the pre-show judging. The schedule is really intense. We have so many different stuff to do, but I think I can deal with the pressure. <laughs> <laughs> bam, bam. <laughs>